Heading to the track and need some glory for your crown? Forget the hats <laughs> and feathers and go for flowers for your head instead. Pillarine Tilk from Belfield Blooms is the Fresh Awards Florist of the Year and she joins us now to show us how to make your own. This is such a great idea. Tell me how we start. Where, where, where did this come from? What's this? So, first you find some bush or wine or anything, like yes. bendy. Yes. You make it like a shape. You, like, wire it together and your size. Oh, my goodness. Same, the size for the top of your head? Oh, yeah. So, this is just like, the, you just kind of twitch yeah. the wire. Oh, yeah. wow. So, they could, you could make that of anything. Yep. But you've made these, you've prepared these ones for us, which yep. are a whole lot of little bits and pieces made yeah. into the same thing. Yeah. And now what do we do? What's our next so step? So, basically, I have pre-prepared for you, both of you, some flowers here. Yep. It smells beautiful. And by you can the way. stick them in. So basically oh. you take a flower. Okay. Take your All right, let me take some little flower, flowers here. Yeah. Yep. And just, just stick them in. Oop. Oh, this is fabulous. This is actually a really therapeutic thing to do too. It's yeah. relaxing. <laughs> so um so I, I, if you didn't want to make this actual sort of headpiece on its own, mm. can you put fresh flowers onto hats or, yeah. or headbands or That's things you already idea. have? So we have a beautiful model here. We do. She's and had a rough day. And you can buy the little uh, from the a comb. textile yeah. shops and then go to the florist and ask uh, flowers and... And you've so made it fascinating. Wire it together, That's incredible. Yeah, the ribbons. Are, are there any tips for it to say looking fresh throughout the day? It's basically just water. Just put sprinkles of water on it every now and then. Or a so spray. Take a little, take a little mister with mister? you. Mister, yeah. Oh. Or go just to have a little water like... Just a little bit on your fingers, yeah. just to mist it on the flowers. Now, this has kind of become a bit of an, a, an event to make flower crowns. It takes a time, be prepared. It's not like five-minute thing. It's actually a few hours process. And do you, t do you do things with groups, with big groups, when they come and make flower we crowns? We can, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's, it's, but you just need to go over with each step. Like, here's some pre-mates with natives. Oh, beautiful. Um, I'm not powerful. very good with my... I like natives. But, so, you know how there's there's fashion, there's an actual something that's in fashion each year, like for, for Derby Day, we've got to go black and white, for Cup Day, you've got to be... Gone. Are there particular flowers that go in and out of fashion? There's always classics. Yeah. You can go with colourful flowers, like long-lasting ones during the day, all yes. time, it's carnations. Right. Or the Charlton Wax Little Blooms. Yes. They will last throughout the day. OK. So it's always good to use. Okay, I think brilliant. it's beautiful. And you'd probably have a lot of hats and fascinators. Do you have trouble storing them? I, I don't, actually. You don't? Have <laughs> too much. Okay. I've, I've, no, I've got a perfect bit on top of my wardrobe where my hat's oh. gone. Actually, it's just a, an old-fashioned wardrobe that yeah. works like that. But I think the um, perfect thing is that you don't have to store these. No, you can they're fresh can, for the day. Yeah, and go to compost later. I so if I'm what, doing my uh, you mentioned well. that these last. Yep. Is there a flower that's particularly in season at the moment? You know, I'm looking at that beautiful blue. What, mm. What's that? Is that a cornflower? That's a cornflower. Is that in season at the moment? It's Can we get that easily? It's in season now. Um, it's really a bit fragile. Is it? Um, for flower crowns. We used to have them. It's our Estonian national flower. Oh, there you go. Uh, and we have them during our singing festival all around the head. How beautiful. Oh, wow. A, so, king, a king protea would be um, difficult to fashion into a head crown, is it? It's or... too heavy. <laughs> but you could whack it on a hat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, on a heavy hat. Could, yeah. In fact, that would, be, that would be gorgeous. What are your plans for Melbourne Cup? Uh, well, to, to wear. Oh, oh, that's top secret at this <laughs> early it, stage. Is it? Is it? Because the thing is, if you made this, I don't think you'd be able to take it into state. Mm -hmm. You'd have to. So this is something you'd take on to, the day. To, on the day, your own yeah. state. It's almost like, like uh, you can't go wrong, can no. you? Because I, I don't. I mean, I don't know how attractive that that looks. But shall we? <laughs> go try it on. Oh, that looks great. Does it? Yeah. Oh, well, that's it. Well, you just you can't go wrong. Can now you? you don't always get a sunny day on track. No. What happens to one of these if it rains? They're perfectly fine. It's they actually good. It. <laughs> they love it. It actually thrives. It's actually a good thing. So yeah. there you go. Does, does it attract bees? <laughs> uh, some can do. Yes. <laughs> But there's probably not too many of these in yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, do, you yeah, have, yeah, yeah. do you have much demand for this? Do you have people coming into your florist and asking for this sort of stuff? Um, oh, and you well, look, we are still oh, new. And You're still As new. New florist. We opened up in March. Ah, so this is where they should come. <laughs> yeah, but I can obviously prepare them. Put put one on. Mm -hmm. And when you, well, I love this one. Actually. You love that one? Okay, yes, because mm -hmm. they've made. Oh, that's very pretty. Oh, mm. that's lovely. And you kind of almost look virginal. 
Oh. Yeah. <laughs> virgin, virgin on the ridiculous. Thanks for that, Norella. <laughs> and thank you, Pilarine. Thank you thank so you. much for coming. These are absolutely gorgeous. I think that wasn't hard at all. We could all do that. Thank you for joining us. Oh, no, no worries. Any time. I'm Come about to Belfield Blooms and ask. Lovely. <laughs> now that we're fascinated already, Nat Hunter will take us inside another deluxe birdcage experience in just a few minutes.